Hey guys, today I want to go over the basics of how to use layers in Procreate. I just want to say right off the bat that I'm not an artist at all. Um, so I don't really use Procreate for drawing. I use it more so for digital planning, but I use layers in pretty much everything that I do. Every time I write a new word in my planner, I create a new layer and that way I have the ability to move it around freely um, and I can resize it on its own and then once I'm happy with the look of things then I merge my layers together so first thing um, you need to know is right when you create a new document in procreate it will give you um, and this is for when you create a blank document not when you import a photo um, it'll just automatically start that first layer for you so I'm on layer number one right now which it automatically has there for me so I'm just gonna write the number one and now I'm gonna create a new layer by going to my layers and clicking the plus sign and I'm gonna change the color for this and I'm gonna write two um, so anyway now I've got five layers and if you want to, let's say I wanted to just move this one around right here. I would go to my layers and I would select where I can see the one. And now I can move that around on its own. I can resize it. Um, I can flip it. I can do all of that stuff with just the number one. So now let's say I wanted to move all of these layers around, but I didn't want to merge them together yet. How I would do that is I would go to my layers and one is still selected since that's the last one that I just selected. And now I would just swipe on the other layers to select all of them together. And now I can move all of these layers together without merging them. And I can resize them. I can do all of the same stuff that you can do with individual layers you can do when you have multiple layers selected. So now, if I wanted to group these layers, um, I would do that by, again, I would go to my layers and I would swipe to select the ones that I wanna group. And then I would select these lines in the upper right-hand corner and that would create a group. And so now, when the group is selected, it selects all of the layers that are in that group. But also, I still have the ability, since they're not merged, to select individual um, parts of that group and move those around freely as well. So that's how you group layers. Um, to merge layers, there's a few different ways that you can do it. So one way is to just select, make sure your layers are stacked how you want them to be stacked. Um, and you can just click merge down over and over until all of them, now they're all on one layer. So that's one way that you can merge multiple layers together or just two layers together. Um, but for that to work, you do have to make sure the layers that you want to merge are directly on top of each other. And I'll show you how to do that in a minute. Um, so now I'm gonna undo that and I'm gonna show you another way to merge layers. Okay, so another way to merge layers is to select all the layers that you want to merge and then pinch and I don't like to do it that way because it's kind of um, clumsy I don't know sometimes it adds a layer that you don't mean to merge um, but maybe you'll be better at it than I am um, but I just wanted to show you that that is an option so now these are one layer again and now I'm going to undo that and okay, let's say, for example, that I wanted to merge the numbers five and one and make those just one layer, but leave the other one separate. Um, and I wanted to do it using the merge down method. So right now, five th these have three layers in between them. Um, so five is up here, one is down here. Um, I need to get the five either above or below the one to merge them together. So, I'm gonna just select layer number five and just drag it down. And now I can click on layer number five and click on merge down. And now one and five, oh, 
yeah, one and five are on a layer together, and two, three, and four are still on their own individual layers. So now let's say I want to um, group the numbers four and two together. So how I can do that is I can go to my layers and I'm just gonna select four, but I could do this with two as well and bring it to four. But I'm gonna select four and I'm gonna bring it. And when I see that the box around two has turned blue, um, I'm gonna let it go and that creates a group. So that's just the basics of how layers work and how you can move them around and group them and merge them. Um, I personally, you know, I keep everything separate and then once I'm happy with it, I either group the stuff together or merge it together um, once I'm just totally satisfied with it. So feel free to contact me if you have any questions about this at all. You can reach me on Facebook. You can contact me through my website. You can contact me on Instagram. I will link to all of those in the video description. Thanks.